Heather Locklear will soon leave the psychiatric ward at UCLA to undergo long-term treatment for substance abuse and mental health issues The troubled actress was placed under a 52-50 hold, where a clinician can involuntarily admit a patient for up to 14 days earlier this week A source linked to Locklear's family told TMZ during her time at the hospital, doctors performed a number of tests to try and understand her recent behavior They concluded the Melrose Place star was suffering not just from substance abuse issues but also from mental health issues Locklear has agreed to voluntarily check herself into a long-term treatment program, though some close to her are concerned this means she could check out at any time Those close to the actress believe they would be unable to get a conservatorship, allowing someone to take control of Locklear's decisions until she is more stable and say they will not be applying to the court for one Locklear was arrested on Sunday night after downing a bottle of tequila and crashing her Porsche into a pylon on the grounds of her California mansion, Daily Mail revealed last week The troubled actress, a 56, then attacked the cops when they arrived to calm her down and was arrested and booked into Ventura County Jail on police battery charges Share this article Share she was released on Monday morning but was rushed to hospital a little over six hours later after allegedly taking an overdose Sunday's arrest comes exactly a week after Locklear was cuffed and taken to hospital after choking her mother Diane, 85, and threatening to shoot herself After being released from hospital on Tuesday, June 19, the troubled Melrose Place star allegedly checked into a detox center but checked herself out again after completing just two days of a five-day program On the way home from the detox center on Sunday morning, she purchased a bottle of tequila which she drank before later attempting to drive off in her Porsche <laughs>